Despite the fact that near placements are so common, over 70,000 per year in Canada, people might be surprised to find out that up to 10% of patients have uh, the need for revision surgery where they have to repeat the surgery again because there's some complication or infection or loosening. Uh, and up to one in five patients actually might be dissatisfied after the surgery because they have ongoing pain or other discomfort. For a knee replacement to be successful, in the weeks after surgery, the bone has to grow in around the implant and all the soft tissues in the joint have to heal again after the trauma of the surgery. So some research has indicated that the microbes that live in our gut actually can influence inflammation throughout our body and also influence the absorption of nutrients that bone needs to heal. So in our study, we're doing a randomized trial giving patients a uh, probiotic, which we hope will boost the beneficial bacteria in their gut and potentially enhance that bone and growth and healing in the weeks after surgery. We all have a microbiome and that microbiome um, is a, actually a large part of why we're healthy and so we have this collection of microbes in our body, largely bacteria but also viruses and fungi and other things and you know there's a huge contribution uh, to our health through that microbiome. So uh, a healthy person um, has a microbiome that's producing vitamins and uh, other things which cross over into our system and help promote healing. So this is a you know study of uh, 30 subjects over six weeks and you know they'll get a pretty high dose of uh, probiotics is what, what we're hoping and you know at the same time we want to know that we're making a difference so it goes uh, in partnership with some fairly advanced imaging to keep an eye on what's going on and, and some other parameters too. So we're, we're hoping that we can actually see a difference in this group and if we do see a difference we can do, then do a much larger study 